Greetings, my friends. This is Gilles Mancillon. I hope you're having a good day. I thought I'd come and wish you um, to, to, to speak about transcendental psychology, as usual. Uh, I'm going to pull a card for the day. For uh, there is very, very. We, we do have to prepare because it's been announced that there is a that there is a, a countdown for this. This the, the sun is accumulating energy and will liberate a great plasma. Plasma flare, like plasma energy that will that will englobe the whole planet and everything will change forever after that. But how do we prepare for something we do not know yet? So the best way, I, what I recommend, is is to remove as much as possible the toxins and the stimuli, the everything that that excites us, to to slow down the mind and to be to be in a receptive mode. And uh, we'll see what happens. For, for once that happens, everything will change. The, the consciousness will be so raised. The many that are just will not be ready for ascension, will leave the body and continue the journey elsewhere. And those who are ready for ascension will be able to ascend, but at least we'll, we'll be setting up the base for a new society. And uh, the card of the day is co-creation, the understanding, the power of co-creating, co-creating with your soul, your spirit, your, the, your creator, your guides, your, your friends, your family, your, your, your business partners, your, your, your associates, the people that... It's all co-creating, um, but we can only co-create on a certain level with the people. We Sometimes to create the, these higher planes, we need to, to connect with... to co-create, we need to co-create with, uh, with higher intelligence, because the people are not always... Have, have the vision to, to, to allow themselves to, to envision the, this possibility. And, and life, is to, in any event, is a co-creation with the Creator, the, the Supreme Creator. I also wanted to say that, talk about the UFO and extraterrestrial. It's on the table in the mainstream media in America. There is no more going around it. And the Creator has given the permission to the Pleiadian and the Galactic Federation to show themselves and interact with humanity. So be prepared. They're going to go slowly, but they're going to they're gonna be coming. I also wanted to say that as humans, I'm only sharing ideas and perspectives, text whatever resonates with you, but as, as humans we are expected to make mistakes. There is no way we're not going to make mistakes as humans. Everybody makes mistakes. So, so it's like the, the key is to learn and change whatever, from, to learn from our mistakes. If we repeat a mistake twice knowing the mistake, it is a mistake, it is, a, it is usually a choice. So, but... Uh, but also having to accept certain losses. We, we have to lose certain aspects of ourselves and we have to trust that they will be replaced by something better. So, so it's about trust and faith in your soul plan, in your creator, and connect to your inner child as much as possible. The inner child is the link to the, the higher plane, the six dimensional realm, fifth, six, seven, di fifth, six, di six dimension. So, um, also becoming aware that this life is just a dream. When, when we die, we, we realize that it was just a dream. But we do have to play the game. We do have, if, we're not, if we don't play the, our own role, what we're called for, then, then we, life will, will happen to us rather than from our creation. So we do have to play the game, to play our role, to be ourselves, to focus on knowledge, on light and freedom. And understanding that we all experience traumas in this life, but we are not that trauma. We are the healer that brings the healing to the traumas we might have had or experienced. And also understanding we are all unique beings in the whole of creation, therefore we are very precious to God. God cares very much for all of his children, regardless of the appearances. For the inner values will be a lot more useful to navigate those times rather than forms and appearances. For for, um, for it's normal to feel pain, to feel fear, to feel doubts as humans, and we need it to, to accept a certain level of ignorance and, uh, and, and darkness. When we came in a human body, it was normal, but we want to let it go and, um, and connect to our, to our inner self. And then the, the gift of telepathy and so on will, will, is, will unfold more and more. For me, it's been a long time, but, but it's only when there is a match frequency on the soul level that those things can become possible. And so... Um, so the the way I, I pull some cards with this maybe I'm gonna pull some cards with the toy and um, for so, so one thing I realize also is that my 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 physical appearance my, my this physical garment this body is is and I, I, this is true for everybody in truth but I am realizing that for myself is actually a pro holographic projection of my higher consciousness that projected me here in this time in this in this um in this reality and so the more we ascend the more we become conscious and the more we are able to use the avatar and raise its frequency to to achieve new things 
uh, pull some cards. The, the observer is traveling, so getting ready for, for that. The past is the breakthrough, is the opening of the heart, it's the strength. The present is the master, we're moving into our mastery path. And the future is the elevation of our consciousness. On the inner world, we have to forgive, forgive ourselves. It's all about guilt. and So, so we just need to forgive ourselves for our mistakes. It's, it's just learn from it and everything will, as God, God will fix it, will heal it. Will, and what's on the outside world is going with the flow. It is love, it is, it is happiness. It is just about leaving the resistance, letting go of the mind and flowing with the flow. And uh, because in the, in the inner world, once we let go of the, the self-judgment and, 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 and guilt, we, we, we move into the rubble, the, the, the emperor, the, the, the hot seat. Huh? The, we, we're going to have a lot of responsibility in the coming times. Sometimes I, I, I go through like, difficult periods of time emotionally, and uh, sometimes I wonder why I left my original state for I know my original state will always be it is an eternal my, it is my true self and my eternal being will never depart from who I am on the original plane and um, as a little story many years many years ago I was revealed this and uh, is that um, a long time ago uh, before the creation of the universe we were living as a spirit group and God came to us and, and showed us this samsara the universe of universes we were like what is that? <laughs> what is that? Do we really, do we want to say we trust God, of course? And so we, we made an experiment and we realized through the experiment that we created, it was very short, very quick, that this process of integrating the universe and the timeline and we would create tremendous suffering, but tremendous joy at the end. So we, it was approved by our group. And so I, I engaged myself into this process. Sometimes I feel like... There was days where I feel like, did I really want to do that? <laughs> but um, but it is to to understand that God has prepared a, a point of li freedom and uh, freedom and liberation at the end once we we fulfill the, our own um, our own our own. Uh, program eh, on, on past that our soul has decided for every lifetime we we choose to explore certain theme and we choose to 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 learn certain lessons at the end of life we we, we evaluate how much did we get of that did we learn all the lessons but there has been a lot of cleaning up and a lot of cleaning up throughout the whole milky way galaxy for it's like this whole galaxy was has had to be cleaned up on the earth, it's, uh, the cleanup happened in the Vatican, in the city of London, in Washington, for those who are the power centers. But, but there's still much, to, much cleaning up to do on the physical plane. But as the solar flash happens, a lot of the people, the AI beings and, uh, and the dark souls, will, will, will be forced out of the body. They will, be, they will find another evolution point, pass. And so, um, but um, uh, much darkness has been released. Huh? Um, as far for me, it's like I, I felt the need to, to regain the control of the obelisk because they, they, they used the obelisk to, 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 to create their field. And, uh, but the one in Paris, I, I cleared it. I had a lot of resistance from a lot of dark entities, but I, I implanted the, the divine light within it. I may have to, to, do, to go back and, and do more of that, but this, this one is like, they don't have this one anymore. anymore. So, um, so, so, so I'm going to finish with a song. I thank you so much for your, for your support. I thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing. I'm looking forward to this new phase. Huh? It's, uh, I'm going to finish with a song. I, I was uh, unintentionally got implicated in some deep emotional connection with someone. Uh, Spirit says it's from a past life. Says, I had no choice. I had to go through that. And then eventually she blew me off. So, so I had to go through a lot of deep pain and sorrow. But I know it wasn't, wasn't really um, just the way it is. And, and still love, when it comes, when you feel this love, this connection, we try anyway. Huh? We can, uh, or sometimes we say we suffer too much. We'll never do that again. But then we will we'll go again and we we'll do it until we find our true match. We find our true soul, the true love, the true soul mate that we have the perfect balance so that we can spend the rest of our life together. For relationships, it's about growth and evolution. So we grow together and evolve. If there is no growth, no evolution, no joy, no kindness, soft, sweet energy then why bother and so um, and so I'm gonna finish with a song <laughs> I was gonna sing another song but this one came to came to mind when I was gonna make this video so it's about holding on not holding on to the past but holding on to our face when we feel this state of, of feeling pain we, we have to hold on to the face to know that they will things will change and huh? it's called everybody hurts when the day is long 
and the night, the night is yours alone. When you're sure you've had enough of this life, hang on. Don't let yourself go, cause everybody cries, everybody hurts, sometimes, sometimes everything is wrong, now it's time to sing along. When your day is night alone, hold on. If you feel like letting go, hold on. If you think you had too much of this life, well, hang on. Cause everybody hurts. Take comfort in your friends. Everybody hurts, don't throw your hands, no, don't throw your hands. If you feel like you're alone, no, 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 you're not alone. If you're on your own in this life, the days and nights are long. When you think you've had too much of this life, hang on. Well, everybody hurts sometimes. Sometimes everybody cries and everybody hurts sometimes. So hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Well, in a sense, I was to say that. Don't hold on to a relationship if it's not working. Don't hold on to a pain if it's... Yet yeah, just feel it and allow itself to be healed. Just bring your love and light into a situation to heal them. And sometimes things people come back when it's time. <laughs> it's just life in. Expect miracles uh, for like the Stoic. There is certain things we have no power over, and certain things we do have power over. There are certain things that we have no choice over, and certain things we do have choice over. There is no use putting our energy to to fight with we, which we have no choice, and uh, this is outside of our power. And so, um, the the weakness of the of, the, of that project of the Epictet uh, Stoicism is that the Stoic were always getting ready for the worst. And <laughs> I prefer to tell you to get ready for the best in the quantum film it makes more sense so the, the card of the day the, the, the observer of the day is authenticity the highest wisdom is patience to be able to be calm to be to be serene take time for yourself as well and um, uh, what needs to be understood is the courage to overcome our fear and to, to, to move forward what we need to do is love, to continue to cultivate love. Love is love. Eh? It's like, even if it's not reciprocated, still be kind, be, be gentle, be, accept the, the, the situation. For unconditional love needs no reciprocation. And the outcome will be purification. This solar flash will really, really purify a lot of things. And then galactic technology will assist in major, majorly clean up as well. And so, but continue to purify yourself if possible to, to get the, to, to reach a lighter point, to, to, to elevate the, the, the frequency of our body, slow, slowly but surely. Well, thank you very much, which is a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.